the handheld steady gimbal G4 and 3 axis. It also could also put the GoPro 3, the GoPro 4 LCD backpack. Let's open it up. And here we have the card. Put your warranty information here. Model number, agency, and customer address. Warranty card. Read this first for the software updates, firmware. Just to update it. There you go. This is a handheld steady gimbal, G4 3 axis. And some instructions. The function interface instructions and just pretty much instructions how to use it and what you should know. And some accessories. Also check out my other video that I did for this one too, for the, the extension pole. And also very good videos on that. Okay, here we have the rechargeable batteries, they come in two here. And another one, another set. It's always good to have extras. There you go, they give you two. Here. Nice good packaging here to keep everything safe and secure. Here we have the G4 itself. Let's check it here. Here we have the cables, the USB to update the firmware. Here we have just like the app, <laughs> the nice compact USB. Very different, different in Europe. And here we have the screws, the long one. We guess you have the uh, one. Yeah. And here's the USB connector for the upt firmware update. And here to the final we have the G4. And from here, put it out like this. Nice and good. And we also have a charger for the batteries. Good to have. Let me show you by I hear them. Let's look in the gimbal itself in the side view. This would be your block here, would be your GoPro. It's imaginary to GoPro. Here's a switch, not a switch, but here's a to connect it for any firmware updates. Right there. And you just put it back so secure it. Nice protect it. And the other side we have the button. And this was a mode switching. And you press it. Yeah. Here the back. We have there. And at the bottom we have the switch, power switch. Now let's put a GoPro on it, see how it looks. Okay, you place this black foam with the GoPro 3 black. It's solid. Pretty much stick the screws here and screw them. 
ですけど、ね。Once you have enough, you think you have enough room, you just push this back. Also, because these are threaded, you have to just make sure you go all the way. Replace the GoPro like so. There. Once you have it there, it's cute, nice and snug. Put the screws in, make sure they're long enough. And screw it. Once you have it nice, a bit more, needs more. So what you do, just keep going. When you do one side, don't do it too tight, just, you know, a little bit. Then the next side, on the other side. Once you're feeling the pressure a little bit, just do a little bit tight enough, finger tight. Then the other side. Now to do both sides, you're good. Just enough space right there. Same right here. Right there. And secure. Once you have that done, pretty much ready to just put the batteries in. Okay, once it's nice, secure and nice all the way in, place it nice and flat on the table, flat surface. So now you just push the power button in the bottom. And as you can see, you're turning it. You see the light also blinking because the power is on. Right now it's just being steady. See, just being steady by itself. Three axes. Also, this side as well. Nice and steady footage right there. So now let's take a look. The light back. It's flashing right now. It's it's flashing blue, to which indicates it's full power. So the battery is fully charged. Hope you enjoyed my video of my handheld steady gimbal, GH4, three axis. I have the link in the description where I got it. You guys can check it out. And thanks for watching.